Data Design Corporation is a turnkey electronic design and product manufacturing company. We provide custom electronic design solutions in embedded processing, RF and optical communication, instrumentation, digital signal processing, and power management. We have an integrated uh, process at, at our place, so we, we have the electronic design engineers there at just about every level and discipline. We have FPGA and DSP developers, and we have test engineers, and we have software engineers at firmware and, and the driver and application layer. So we kind of take all that based on the requirements that the customer gives us, and we hand them kind of a design package with, you know, here's working prototypes, here's the documentation you need to make those prototypes, and typically they'll, you know, they'll come back to us and say, okay, we'll make, make more of them. Our current customers are research institutions like universities and national laboratories, large system integrators, OEMs, uh, but just about anybody who has, a, has an idea that requires an electronic design solution that also has somewhat of a realistic idea of what's involved in the scope of these projects uh, is a potential customer. Currently we're developing our flash-based products to assist our customers in data processing, search and storage, or even managing you know, extreme data sets on the multi-petabyte level. And we're, we're really targeting the fact that the NAND flash is much lower power, um, much higher density, and just requires a lot less infrastructure to use the NAND flash instead of you know, traditional spinning media. The challenges we had with standard NAND were not unique to us. Uh, NAND flash has, has errors, and especially with the MLC devices, the, you know, these errors are, are quite extensive in the part, and they have to be dealt with. So we were running into the problem in that we were interfacing uh, a NAND device to a different controller just about on every project we had. So we had to, we had to redo how we handled these errors you know, in, a, in, a, in a processor or an FPGA or a custom controller. Uh, every time a, a customer came to us with a, with a new requirement, we were constantly dedicating resources to, to dealing with these errors all over again every time. And the, the clear NAND device really just erases that problem from our end. And it, it's really a value-added service that Micron's providing built into its part. So we can just interface and get the data out without having to worry about uh, how on this project we're going to handle the errors. The value added feature of the built-in ECC and the clear NAND device is really ideal for the types of products that we do. We don't have to keep reinventing how we handle the errors every time we interface a NAND device to a new type of controller. And with data coming in at five gigabytes per second in some of our products, the amount of resources and IP to required to handle those errors is almost impossible and very cost prohibitive. One of the products that we're making is a high-end PCI Express solid-state storage device. This product would not have been possible for us to produce had it not been for a, a managed NAND technology such as Micron's Clear NAND. It really enabled us to achieve the, the density and the, the power and the IOPS that are required for what our customers are, are looking for. In order to get performance of one and a half million 2K byte I.O. ops out of a hard drive, you'd have to chain together about a hundred of them in a complex RAID system to get that kind of performance out of it. The power budget for that, if each hard drive is about 20 watts, that's about 2,000 watts of power. And with our PCI Express board, uh, we're doing that with a budget of about 60 watts. Micron provided us with, with two key pieces. One is the built-in ECC algorithms built into the clear NAND device. The other one is we got a, you know, we got a lot of support for them in integrating this new part uh, to our, our controller. Micron gave us early access to the clear NAND device and that gave us the confidence to proceed with developing uh, this product that would not have been possible for us to develop had we not had 
had this product. And they've also been providing us with a lot of support in working out uh, our, in designing our interface in the controller. We're going to keep developing products now that we have this uh, feature of, of built-in ECC because as, as the density of these parts increases and the process technology of producing the parts gets smaller, there's going to be more errors. And eventually the, the controllers required to, to deal with these errors uh, at the density that we need is it's really going to be impossible. So it's, it's crucial to have the built-in ECC feature of, of, the, of the ClearNAND device in, in order to, to realize the type of products that, that we want to produce. Thank you.